your help, fellas. <laughs> Thought I'd have to rent me a bulldozer. Don't need a bulldozer when you got us. <laughs> Out there, I got serious TV watching to do in here. Oh man, this is Beth McKinley at Lovely Loch Ness, and with me today is Mr. Paddy McFarlane, who claims to have sighted the Loch Ness monster, or as she's fondly referred to by the locals, Nessie. Oh, there's no claims to about it, lassie. I see the beastie with my own two eyes in the broad light of day. Yet. Huge it was, with a great lizardy head and vast jagged teeth like a fearsome dinosaur. Guys! Get in here, guys! Is there a dinosaur in the lock? Does Nessie even exist? Stay tuned for any new news on Nessie. Well, I done heard Nessie's a giant sea snake from the days Loch Ness was attached to the sea. But in those drawings, she doesn't look like a snake. If there's a chance it's a real dinosaur, we should check it out. Absolutely. Hot man, we be off to Bonny, Scotland. Huh? huh? Uh, just practicing. Thanks for the lift, Jedra. Good luck. I hope you find what you're looking for. Yeah, me too. Do you hear that? It's so familiar. It's a Stegosaurus lullaby. I'm sure of it. A Triceratops lullaby! My mom sang that to me when I was an egg! <gasps> ah! It's a herd of Nessies coming to have us for their supper! Scoot, Wally, scoot! Hmm. This merits further investigation. No, no, no! That's not it either! Don't you remember? It's what our mothers sang when they wanted us to come. I never listened to Mom. It went kind of like this. No, it didn't! It was like this. Keep that up and you're gonna scare the thing away! Then play, you lazy trilobite! Play! Oh. <gasps> hey, I think he's got it! Begodnobrachiosaurus! Bigger than a Diplodocus! <laughs> Big enough to give the expendable dinosaurs the fright of their lives. <gasps> I've had it. Play, you hopeless hadrosaur! Play! <gasps> Can anyone play these things? <laughs> That's cold! Ah, I'm freezing! And who'd you say you are again, laddie? Doing Cats, Weekly Weirdness News. Did these Nessies look anything like this? Oh, aye! That's a lot of them! You seen them before, then? Oh, yes. Uh, I've been tracking them for a while now. Now tell me again. Anything and everything. I've never heard the Nessies the like of this bunch. About nine foot tall. We for a Nessie, mind you. But big enough. 
I'm standing upright like a man. Like a man? Oh, aye. And strangest of all, the Nessies talked like men too. What did they say? Well, this spiky one, he seemed to be very smart. He said, this merits further investigation. Indeed it does, my friend. Indeed it does. Perfect. Low profile. Defensible. No more close encounters with local civilians. Hey, how's that hookup coming? Almost there. Got it. I've linked all the local channels, including feeds from every camera pointed at the lock. Got the shopping channel there anywhere? No, Bullseye. We've got to get the big picture here on this nest monster thing. I would be seeing the big picture if you let me bring my widescreen TV. Look at that crummy little picture. Deal with it, Bullseye. We're not on vacation here. No. I mean, really. Look at that picture. What is that? Good eye, Bullseye. Sticks, isolate and enhance that. Certainly. Enhancing image, extrapolating shadow areas, now we're getting something. Hey, Stiggs, you're on TV. He sure is. Stiggs, Bullseye, go check it out. Look, bananas. They're all yours, you brainless behemoth. All you have to do is smash the plywood dinosaurs. We've tried peaches, rhubarb, turkey bacon. She's not going for any of it. Ugh, what's the use of having a giant monster if I can't make it smash my enemies? Ugh. I think I'm going to pass out. Spitter, no! <laughs> Follow your hunches and you just might get a bullseye. I had it. I'm freezing and my lungs are shot. You quit when I tell you to quit, you lazy lummox. Now play! Hey, I did my part. I got this stupid beast to come. I don't see you being so successful. I said... Lay. Since when did you become such a bagpipe aficionado? Oh, the bird and the buzzsaw. What's with all the food? Having a picnic? Yeah, and the food's on you. One hundred thousand dollars? $300,000? I'm gonna be rich. <laughs> Explain yourself, mammal. <laughs> <clears throat> Hi, Dwayne Katz, Weekly Weirdness News. Uh, question, dinosaurs are known to have extremely minute brains. So tell me, how did you learn to talk? <laughs> I hate mammals. Get rid of him. Immediately, and with great pleasure. Uh, uh, no, wait, stop! <laughs> Sorry for the mammal, feel sorry for yourself! What have you done? What's wrong with you? What the? Oh, man, not the 
that's uh, Weekly Weirdness News. Question. Out of my face, mammal. Hey, watch it. A guy's gotta make a living. You're lucky to be living. Hey, okay, point taken. Question. What are dinosaurs doing at Loch Ness? I have a question for you. What? Can you swim? Yes, why? <gasps> feeling about what those scale heads are up to. Wait! And come back! She has such potential! There's got to be a way to make her attack those dinosaurs! We're down to the last crate! Kippered Herring? <laughs> Crates of Kippered Herring. I think it's time our Nessie met the real dinosaurs. This is Beth McKinley live from the annual Highland Games and Bagpipe Competition. Today we'll be seeing plenty of caber tossing. Hammer hurling? And the always popular grease pole climbing event. <laughs> we'll also be hearing the lovely music of our many bagpiper competitors. So get comfortable and enjoy the show. Who knows? Maybe even Nessie herself will make an appearance. Maybe not Nessie, but some other big scaly creatures. You can count on that. <laughs> Kippered Herring. Who would have guessed such an insignificant fish would be the extraneous dinosaur's undoing? I think Nessie's ready for some dinosaur dessert. But how do we get T-Bone Head and his guys to come to Nessie? That goody T-Rex. I've got just the ticket. Just let me borrow your camera guy. I'll get you the story of the century. If there's a story to be had, I'm the one who's getting it. Shaken more than a wee bit. Hey, this is my story. It's yours. It's the story of a lifetime. How can you not like the sound of a bagpipe? Oh, Ian! Ian! Wake up! Damn, wimps! Come on, you big million-dollar story of a lifetime. Whoa! Guys! Did you see that? Check it out! That was Spitter! The Raptors at the Highland Games? Let's glaciate them. Stinks! Bullseye! Help those people! Spike, you with me. I knew they'd come. Bring him down. Ready to rumble, Spikester? To try Ceratops have spikes? End of the line, bad rap. For you, yeah. Now, Spinner! Chivo, huh? Spike, let's get these people out and get over there. Perfect. The bird and the buzzsaw will come to the rescue and Nessie will have them all. Spinner, the pipes, now! That 
thing could swallow a brontosaurus whole and have room for dessert. Yeah, I think we're meant to be dessert. Hatch the fish now! Not me, you great lummox. Them! It's them you want. Dump it on the excessive dinosaurs. <laughs> what is this stuff? Herring? Yeah. She seems to like it. Swim! That was close! Spike, the grappling hook, now! We gotta do something! Hmm, most assuredly. You turn all the speakers so they're facing the lake. That's gonna help T-Bone and Spike? Trust me! And what are you gonna do? I'm gonna practice my bagpipe playing. <laughs> Gotta do better than that. We'll need full amplification. No. That's not it. Yes! What are they trying to do? Spinner, keep playing! <sighs> keep moving, Spike. She's gaining on us. <laughs> it's not working. Stegs' song is having no effect on Nessie. Oh, can't keep this up, Teeb. I think we're gonna be dinner sores right about now. What's going on? I hope I didn't make things worse. What exactly did you do? I finally recognized Spitter's song. It's what mother plesiosaurs sing to call their children. That thing's a baby? Yes, so I remembered the song that dinosaur children sang to call their moms, and I phoned home. Seems like mom isn't too happy. Hey, wait a second! He made me do it! Silence, fool! I can handle this. Oh, the pleasure was entirely mine. I think. survived a brutal attack from one of these creatures, I am now prepared to tell you the full, unexpurgated story of the talking dinosaurs. I have incontrovertible proof that they are... Hey, wait, where are you going? Get your picture taken with a world-famous Loch Ness Monster. Incontrovertible proof of his existence. Show the folks back home. No, wait, that's not the Loch Ness Monster. Please, I've got proof right here. All right, move it, Buster. I'm working this side of the lock. That's a terrible likeness. Chedra, my spike's way more fossilaceous than that, isn't it? Oh, definitely. And my eyes, they're a much nicer shade of green, aren't they? Without a doubt. And my teeth, they're much sharper, right? Right? Hey, stop throwing nachos!